You boys ready to tear shit up? We're gonna do something very different for this video. Not normally we just, you know, don't wanna lip and just talk, but we're gonna do something a bit different. You know, I made a video on this a long time ago, but I fucked up. Now, a couple of you already know what it is, but basically, I looked this up on YouTube, and yeah. So, I'm going to shotgun a Mountain Dew. Okay, because I don't want to get super fucked up. And the first one goes good, I might as well like shotgun about two or three. So I get fucking wicked fucked up. It's gonna be fun. Probably shotgun one to two and then pack a big ass lip and just talk. But for any of you that don't know how to shotgun anything, what you do is obviously have a knife. Um wanna hold it like this. Make sure the can is down. Make sure the hole is big enough. And then tilt it up like this. Oh shit, some tripping. See you guys in a few. That's fine. Picked a little bit, but not a whole lot. <laughs> but anyways, let's tell you shotgun the can of soda. Oh, that's how you shotgun in really. What you do? Is you tilt the can out backwards like this, take a knife and poke it right here, and then after that, you just <coughs> um, crack it open. I'll just show you. I got to about halfway of dragging. I got to add, then got to 
squirt it away. I drained through us and then puked, but. <sighs> Holy shit. <sighs> so we did for tonight. Grizzly Dak Wintergreen. Uh, holy shit. Uh. So what else we're going to talk about in this video, besides shark gunning and Mountain Dew and puking, having a dip, and I keep talking. I'm just going to fucking, you know, fucking let one rip. Nah, I don't have gas. I don't have enough gas, but <laughs> yeah. Anyways, we're just gonna go for it. I'm packed with shit. Come on now. Damn, I've been dipping this all day. I've only dipped like. That much. I'm telling you guys, that's why I love Grizzly, because they pack their shit so fucking full. I'm like, you know, Copenhagen, where there's always that big ass pinch missing. People say, oh, Copenhagen's delicious. No, sweetheart, Copenhagen's not delicious. I mean, the flavor's awesome. Don't get me wrong, but. I don't know about you, but I ain't paying fucking. Five bucks for can, almost five bucks for can cope in wintergreen. Fucking that much missing, you know. Grizzly's fucking. Let me get a dip real quick, and I'll show you something really cool. My parents is like, what we're doing. I was like, well, if I can't drink beer in this house, I gotta get fucked up another way. <laughs> ah, yeah. Hmm. Good shit. In case anyone's wondering. Uh, the only time I'll dip Grizzly Dark Wintergreen is in the summer. Otherwise, I'm dipping Grizzly Wintergreen. Long cut. I was probably thinking, but that's the same shit. I'm like, no, nah, it's not. Very right back. Okay. Everybody knows Grizzly Wintergreen, right? Comes in a can like this. Last year, we had sex and came out with this. Look at that shit. It's fucking about the size of my head. Look at that. So remember I was saying that uh, Copenhagen Copenhagen Wintergreen. You know, Copenhagen Wintergreen. Copenhagen made this. The can is fucking big. We get nothing. That can went up before. I got. Hold on. I have to tell the truth now. I got two of these big fuckers. How much I paid for them? 38 bucks. Originally it was 40. But I got a $2 discount because I bought two. Now, most people say, oh, this is disgusting. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Do you think this will be better off with uh, cancer stick smoking? Or would you rather see a world of people spitting all the time? I mean, 
even think about it. Or dip. Only thing, I mean, you designate, designate on your lungs. And that's just cancer causing. But if you take care of your fucking teeth every day like I do now, you'll be fucking fine. Oh, but I'm gonna lose teeth. Okay. Let me be honest with you. See that tooth right there? I didn't lose that from dipping. Because I don't upper dick. I got that because I drink a shit ton of Mountain Dew and other soda drinks. A lot of sugar on it. Now keep in mind I haven't seen a dentist in two years. Basically, my teeth are on its own. I'm, I take care of them every day. I don't want to fucking fall out. And I'll be a toothless fucking hillbilly. <laughs> the old dipper ain't a fucking true hillbilly. I am. Al Wood does not have any missing teeth. Oh, but he says he does because he used to do wrestling back in the day. Ooh. I was despicable. She always a tooth from soda. How I felt I was. Okay, I was in my room watching Ted. I think it was Ted too. And I was eating popcorn and I've been to a, a current I was like, I was like, oh shit, my fucking tooth fell out. I checked and I was like, oh shit, my mom's gonna love this. You know, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, when I started dipping eight years ago, I never would really thought I'd take care of my teeth and brush them, you know. But as I got older, I was like, you know, I'm 23, I started taking care of my teeth, you know. Be responsible. So otherwise, you know, <laughs> be toothless with my dad. <laughs> but back to the smoking versus dipping thing. I mean, think about it logically. How many people die from lung cancer every year? Along with emphysema. You know, stuff like that. We're talking close to like, what is it, like 250,000 people die every year from cigarettes? How many people die every year from dip? Zero. I mean, in a lifetime, people wash their teeth from, well, people die from dip like, um, I think it's like six people died from dipping. You got nothing to worry about. You know, as long as you, if you notice you have any white spots in your gums, you know. It's probably look flaky, which means that you're fucking dipping too much fucking wintergreen and you dip something else real well. I mean, shit, I dip like grizzly wintergreen. I dip like two cans of it. Every day for like five years, and my comes out wicked shitty. But now, now I do something different every day or try to. But you know, what can I say? I'm addicted. <laughs> I'm addicted to, you know. I mean, yeah, it's not fucking cute. Yeah, it's not attractive. Who cares this shit? <laughs> fucking. I know people who fucking do drugs, drink alcohol, you know, dip, chew, smoke cigarettes, weed, stuff like that. Everybody is addicted to something, and if they drop a bad habit for another, trust me, I've done it. 
Okay, I'm gonna tell you something different. I swapped cigarettes to dip. I swapped Mountain Dew for alcohol. I swapped sweet tea from whiskey. You know, and I just stopped smoking weed, but yeah. See, people gotta realize dip is not that bad for you. It's good for you, actually. Because dip helps you shit regularly. Cleans out your mouth. I mean, afterwards, depending on what you dip, you're going to leave a bad aftertaste. So, I suggest having a drink nearby. You know. Also, always use mouthwash or something to rinse your mouth out with, like water. After you're done dipping, if you're dipping long cut, If you're going on a hot date, make sure to carry those pluckers. So you in between your gums and shit. So the long cut won't stay there. Otherwise, your honey won't kiss you. Ain't that right, darling? Yeah. Well, that about wraps her up. So, what am I doing tomorrow? It's Memorial Day. Um... You know, I think I might go fishing. I might go fishing tomorrow. Say, so yeah, I just, you know, I've been playing Xbox, take it easy. You know. It's taking it easy. Oh, yeah. Anyways, do some shout outs and then see you out of here. You got my well void amazing girlfriend, Jessica. Oh, my God, is she cute. Yeah, her and I talked on the phone last night for midnight for a couple hours. Nah, I think it was for an hour. She's really cute. I love her to death. And I can't wait to meet her sometime soon. I'll be down. Next is uh, my buddy. Buddies. Peace and retired farm boys. Jason, Wolper, Stevie, Justin, Tim. Now them good old boys in the farm, getting shit done. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, they're good men, you know. You know, like I said, just because someone thinks you're retarded, doesn't mean you are. I mean, yeah. Next shout out goes to my boy Civil Slash, Mr. Tyler. Tyler, I really want to thank you for cheering me up all week, man. Yeah, I'm in a wicked shitty mood. I remember it's like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, two nights in a row. It was rough. But. I didn't make it through it. But yeah. Didn't make it though. So. Next shit up goes to my buddy. Rory Cower, good man Rory. He's a good man, I have a dodge. He's a pretty cool guy. Oh yeah, Michael Fish was sometime soon. They're pretty cool. Ugh. Ugh. Oh shit. And uh and shit, who else we got? And my buddy Patrick, yep, yeah, he's a good guy. Now he's a good old man. He's a good old man, you know. Works pretty hard. Yeah. God, I'm addicted to Grizzly Wintergreen now. Good man. Well, fuck yeah, Bell. Yes, I do. Old. I just been always said, boy, Dustin Palmer. Dustin, you're a good fucking guy. We need to get more Xbox Live, but Xbox Live time, buddy, so we can play some bitch games together. Oh, fuck yeah. And that, oh, it's just puke you, huh? And that wraps her up. Have a great night, everybody, and happy Memorial Day. All right, guys, have a good one. Take care.